are you one of those great creators looking to have your video stand out with stunning backgrounds like this one or this one? Have you ever wondered how they achieve this? Let me share a little secret with you. It's actually all about lighting. But have you seen the cost of professional light? It can be quite expensive. Now come closer. Let me show you how you can achieve this amazing background using CapCut on your mobile device. And guess what? It's absolutely free. Let's dive in and make your background looks better forever. If you find this video helpful, please subscribe, like and also share with your friends and family. Also leave a comment below to let me know if this works for you. Without any further ado, let's dive right in. The very first thing you want to do is to update your cap cut so that you can have access to this future and to do that you go to your app store or your play store and you search for cap cut like this you click on cap cut like this mine is already updated so that's why it's showing open but yours is going to show update so click on it and your cap cut is going to be updated and once it's updated the next thing you want to do is to open it up and you click on new project now select your project are you one of those great creators and you add it the next thing you want to do is to add this effect which is this rgb light and to do that click on your video like this and you scroll to the right you can see it relights this relight icon you can see is free so once you update your app you are going to see it there so you click on relight and the first one we are going to explore is this fascia now this fascia is like a natural light i will do it now so that you will see it's like a natural light and it's going to be affected only at the back or on your image so i will click on this warm and you can see this applying real light you have to wait for it to finish loading before you do anything or export if not the effect is not going to be added to your video you can see it has turned green so the next thing you want to do is to click on this again and it, this page is going to open now right here you can see light one light two you can add more light if you want if you click on this point whatever light you add is going to be added only to that point where you put this your circle and if you click this direction it's going to form another type of effect which i will show you very shortly so we are going to click on this light one and you click on make leave it at directional and you scroll to down like this if you click on both your effect is going to be added to both your image and your background if you click on people it's going to be added to only you it's not going to affect your background but if you click on background it's going to be added to only your background so what i'm now going to do it i'm going to leave it on background because i want it to the effect to affect only my background and you now come here and start adjusting your colors anything you do under here right now is going to be at the back so just pick any color you want and keep adjusting reducing just make it to suit whatever you want and once you are done click here to do it and you check it here Moving on to the method two, we are going to explore this ambient. I use this teal backlight for my intro video. So you are going to click on this teal backlight. You can see the difference between these two. You can see this color is just to the side. It's not at the back anymore. So click on it again and this thing is going to pop up. Remember to select only the background because that is what I want this light to affect. I have light one, light two and light three. Light one is this one light two is the one to my right which is this one and light three is the middle one which you are going to deselect because i don't you don't want the color to affect your image i'm going to show you how you can deselect any color from yourself now click on light one and you are going to scroll down leave it on directional it depends you can leave it on point if you want but i'll leave it on directional and then i will select the color you want like this select the color maybe you can choose this pink and you start adjusting the intensity you reduce the radius or increase it it all depends on you adjust all the colors like this click on light to select another color maybe like blue adjust it very nicely like this 
or maybe you can choose pink again to fade it since i've used pink already let me choose another color maybe something like this it all depends on on the color you want now to remove these colors from your image what you are going to do is to click on this light three and you scroll to the right like this see this light three color is like this white one you so you click on it and you reduce it to zero and it's going to leave your image reduce it to zero and it's going to leave your image so once you are done just like i said play with the color and make sure you achieve your desired color you click on this one and you click on this check arrow like this and the color will be applied to your image and you export so to the last method we want to explore creative so you click on this creative you can see different light effects here that you can use for your video so instead of using just a plain light see we they've animated it for us so you can just pick any one you like from here i'm going to pick this rainbow 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 light spot you pick it like that and you click on it again so that we can adjust it remember to put it on only background if you put it on people it's going to be on you so put it on only background the only option we have here is to just adjust the light so make sure you reduce the intensity so that it's not too much it's not disturbing your audience reduce the radius a little bit you can as well reduce the distance or increase it but i would like to reduce minus 27 so just do all your necessary adjustments you can reduce the brightness a bit like let's play it so that you will see the effect of the lights are you one of those great creators looking to have your video you can see that cool effect so these are great things you can do with these lights to enhance the quality of your video and to also have that light effect on your video so please like subscribe and also share with your friends and family let me know in the comment section if you will be trying out this amazing cap cut effect in any of your videos bye for now